Before I actually begin this video, I just want to say that I do not condone cheating and that I am not responsible for what you plan to do with this program and what may happen to your account if you use this program. You will most likely not get banned, but there is still a little chance that you may get banned. But as long as you follow my steps and you use the program correctly, you will not get banned. So the first thing that you need to do is click the link in the description down below. Once you're on the website that I am on, all you just need to do is scroll down until you see download Steam Achievement Manager 6.3 hotfix. You just click this link here and it's going to take you to another page which pretty much just says a shortened version of what I just said. And you just click this I read the warning and I still want to download button and it will open up this Steam Achievement Manager .zip file. So to actually open up this file, you need a program called WinRAR. I'll put the link in the description down below. So once you installed both of the programs, just go back to your desktop and you're going to have the WinRAR file. Like I said, you just need to create a new folder and you can just name this Sam and just open up the WinRAR file and you can pretty much copy everything into the folder. And now we have everything that we need in this folder. So let's say I wanted to actually get all of the achievements for TF2 because I don't have any achievements for them. All I just have to do is go back to the SAM folder and open up the SAM picker and it will open up this program that looks like this. You can make it full screen if you like. And these are actually all the games that I actually have on my Steam account. So let's find TF2 which right here. All I just need to do is double click on it and it's going to open up this window that looks like this. And if you actually go to Steam, it will say that you are actually in the game, but you're not actually in the game, which is pretty cool. So now to unlock all the achievements, you can either choose to select the achievements that you want to unlock and click store, or you can click this unlock button and it will choose all the achievements and then just click store. And now as you can see, it says stored 518 achievements and zero statistics. And now if we go back to Steam, as you can see, we have all the achievements for Team Fortress 2. So we just click on the achievement progress you can see that we got all the achievements but this is actually a little suspicious because as you can see it says that we unlocked all of them at the same time which is pretty suspicious i guess so if anyone comes across your steam account they're probably gonna be like oh my gosh he's a hacker and they're probably gonna report you that's why you may get banned for using this program but as long as you like put your profile on friends only or something like that you will most likely not get banned for using this program but like I said, I do not condone cheating. So if you guys actually wanted to remove all the achievements on your account, all you just need to do is go back to the Team Fortress 2 window and then just click this lock button and it's going to lock all the achievements. And if we just go back to our profile, you can see that we have no achievements out of the 518 available. So that is pretty much it. Remember, I do not condone cheating. Use this program at your risk. You will most likely not get banned, but there is still a little chance that you could get banned. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a comment and hit that like button down below for more awesome tutorials like this. Jamal Pack out. Peace.